up guys? Today I'm here with my sister and pals. And pals. Hi. Hi, what's up? I'm actually really nervous because I'm going to my high school and I haven't been to high school. It's been, I graduated in what, 2011? So it's been like six years since I've been to high school. And I didn't have anything to do today. I woke up early, so I'm like, hey, let me go visit my teacher because I've been meaning to visit him for like the past like two, three years. I was just never awake in time. Like school would be out and everything and I thought it'd be weird. So I just texted my sister, hey, I'm not doing anything. So let me go to my high school and see my favorite teacher, Mr. Smith. This is the guy that taught me everything about marketing, reselling, like all that stuff, all that good stuff. I loved marketing when I was in uh, high school. It was my favorite class. I learned so much stuff. All the stuff that I learned from them, I implemented into my life today. And it's, it's kind of just part of who I am. Economics and marketing, it's just something I've just been really interested in. I haven't seen him in forever, so we're gonna go and we're gonna go see my old high school. I'm excited, but I'm nervous. I haven't been to high school in... Have a good day, Ellen. Six, six years. I haven't been here. This is my high school. She goes here now. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna go visit my teacher. Is like my favorite teacher. It's so awkward being here. I had to like have my sister come and escort me out of my yeah. car. No. Go to the band hallway. Everyone will. No one will. Because you fucking tell everybody, huh? No, they saw. You fucking they tell saw. everybody. They saw. I don't tell anybody. They They're just like, who? hey, are you, who's your sister? You should just say no. <laughs> just be like, no. I'm just like, I don't know, are you? Where's Smith? Smith is never here. I used to be a teacher's assistant. Unpack the snacks. They're all crap now. We don't even have ramen anymore. We have ramen right there. Oh, does he give them detention? No. Oh. <laughs> like Smith doesn't do shit. Smith's disciplinary action is like being savage. <laughs> I don't think he's gonna recognize me. He's like outside. The teachers stand outside like after school. Is that a Playboy case? Oh, no, Why is it a play? <laughs> I saw the bunny ears and I saw them sweet pink. I was like, it's Playboy. diva. I always wanted to do this. Oh, I hate you. I didn't do it though. You're just, six just years out of high there. school. Let me just, let me just move you. over here. Oh that was my definitely God. not my Who the fuck did it then? <laughs> not me. Don't snitch on me. I'm gonna delete it before you snitch on me. I was a good kid. Oh, that's a good thumbnail. Sorry, bud. <laughs> hey, you look like me every single day. This is what you kids do. Yeah, but under there, there's cocaine. You're such a motherfucker. <laughs> Did you do it with a pencil? Make the lines? Yeah, that's how you gotta. Chalk dust. <laughs> Gentlemen, come out here, right? Hi. Hi there, where's the other guy? <laughs> what are you ladies want? Hi. Hi, right, they're not gonna do the test. The test doesn't start till tomorrow. Oh. Are you in detention today? No, I'm. Do you... She's in detention. <laughs> Wait, that's your little, your big sister. <gasps> yeah. Oh, you didn't even recognize me. <laughs> well, hold on. Hey, you got ladies. I'll be back. I gotta go talk to a teacher. How long are you gonna be here? You got a few minutes. Yeah, yeah. Because I, don't have I hear you're just doing wonderful things. Do you hold know what on, I'm Ms. doing? What? Do you know what I'm doing? I, I'll compare notes. I'll tell you what I heard <laughs> okay. a year ago, and we'll go from there. <laughs> oh my god. Can you tell me your sister was I'll tell you right now, Mama, I'm gonna let you mess that up. I'll cook, I'll cook no. somebody famous here. <laughs> here, do you want both sisters? Here, get both of them up here. Oh, Come on, no. see, you can, see. So I've been here for 27 years, and I'm a handful of students that are just have a lot of oomph going for them. Oh. Out of the top 10, you're in that list. All right, so I guess I'm coming again, and I'm going to talk to his class. I don't I don't know. I might record it. He says everybody's going to sign photo release forms. <laughs> I don't see how that's necessary, but okay. In case, I hate this school. In case the school wants to sue me. Everybody's got to sign a photo release to be in my video. I haven't been here in so long. Lucky you. Look I'm here my every school. single freaking day. That must be fun. I think it would be fun to go to school, but not do any work, you know? It's fun. Just like go to school. Here. No, you just go to school and then like just talk to your friends and stuff. Like you just see your friends, oh, I but wish. you don't do you don't do any work. I feel like that's what YouTubers that are in high school do. They just, Probably. they know they've already made it. They don't fucking care. So they don't care. They just come to school and talk to their friends and stuff and then just go home. They just don't bother with the work. I mean, school would be fun if you didn't have to wake up super early. My car's so cute. Oh boy. I thought I would stop at Walmart just to get my mom some flowers. Look at the Valentine's aisle. 
it's all empty. I can't find any good chocolate and there's no good flowers. I mean, I'm trying to find better ones and I'm trying to find better chocolate. But it's like everybody's already bought everything and I always do things last second. This is where you go for the better chocolate, but. Oh, these are fancy enough. All right, so I just got in the car. I put everything in the bag. I got her flowers and I just put the chocolates in a red bag and it's really cute and I'm gonna go take it to her right now. Let me see if I can attach this somewhere so we can vlog and talk and drive at the same time. You know, I was supposed to have a thing right here for attaching a camera, but it's like I lost it. Look how cute my mom is. She sent me like the pusheen thing and I'm just like, happy Valentine's Day, I love you. My mom is so freaking cute. She made me meatloaf. Okay, I've been trying to adjust my cam so it sits but it's not sitting. I messed with my car. I messed up my steering wheel. I need to like adjust it back. Uh, it's on one of those like anal bead tripods and it doesn't want to sit anywhere. But yeah, I can't wait to go pick up meatloaf. Meatloaf is my favorite. My mom makes, well everything my mom makes is really my favorite. Oh, it actually sat. Oh, will this actually work or will it not work? So I'm really excited. Turn on the car. Oh wait, it was already on. We just turned it off. Driving and vlogging just does not work for me. Okay, so I... Oh, people are walking behind my car, so it like beeps. But it's like I got a 360 view of the car, so see? You can see all the cars behind me. Oh no! Alright, you can see it when I back out. And we're gonna go see my mom now. Oh shit. Cop, 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 cop. What the fuck am I supposed to do, boy? Jeez, they're giving me the stanky eye. Trying to get me out of the way, there's nowhere I could go except the middle of the road. Ever stretched, ever stretched, that highlight though, that green light though. Happy Valentine's Day! Oh, thank you. Give me fun. Um, Alright, so I just got home. I wanted to tell you guys what happened. So basically, we just sat down. I felt weird about recording. I mean, I tried to like record some of it, but I don't know. We were just sitting and talking and one of the other teachers, he wasn't my teacher, but he was like one of like everybody's favorite teacher. So he came in and he like talked to me. He wanted like, he asked for pictures. He asked for pictures. He was like, maybe my daughter will recognize you because she watches YouTubers and stuff. I was like, hey, that's pretty cool. And I took a picture and we'll see if she recognizes me. I don't know. I feel like a lot of people don't know me, but a lot of people do know me. If you think about it, four and a half million is like a lot of, that's a lot of people, especially because Arizona, Arizona is so small. I don't even think Arizona has four and a half million people in it, which is crazy. I, don't quote me on that because I have no idea. Come here, Dunya. She won't come to mommy. Now she come to mommy. Hi, baby. Kaz wants to play fetch. He gave me his ball. <laughs> I have some herbs right here that I planted before. There's like parsley, basil, mint, rosemary, just because I love fresh herbs. And every time I go to the store and try to get herbs, there's no fresh ones or they're all really gross and dried out. So we just sat and talked about stuff. He was like, he, he really had no idea like where I've been this whole time or what I've been doing because he knows me from my resale business. He thought I was like going to be super successful when I grew up. And he was like the only one, only one that thought I was going to be like successful. Like my parents didn't think I was like my friends didn't think I was. Nobody in my school thought I was. I mean, I didn't even think I was, but he always would like reassure me and always think that I would be successful just because I started a business at such a young age. Like when I was in high school, I had my resale business and he knows me from that and we always used to talk about that. And that's one of the reasons why I really like marketing because it was exactly what I was doing. It was exactly the buying and reselling for more and I learned a lot about what I was doing and about businesses and I don't know, it was just really interesting to me. And yeah, we basically just talked about YouTube and stuff because he didn't know what I was doing. He's not very tech savvy. The other teacher gave him a camera to take a picture of us. And he was like, how do you use this? Like he didn't know how to use the front camera. He didn't even realize, like he was pointing the front camera towards us and trying to take a picture. Oh my God, it's so funny because he's so old. <laughs> he wants me to go to the class and like talk to his students and stuff. When I was in school and had those classes, he always used to have like old students like come in and do that. And I was like, hey, that's pretty cool. And we like looked up to them because they we were all older. And they had their life together and shit. It'd be cool to go there and talk to some kids. Hi, doggos. He just wants to play fetch so bad. Give me the ball. Give me the ball. You see? You see what he does about this ball? <laughs> oh. He thinks I threw it. He doesn't know where it is now. Kaz, where's the ball? Okay, well, I'm gonna go eat me some meatloaf. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to hit that like button in the face and subscribe to the Wolf Pack. I love you guys so much. Thanks for watching. Bye, guys.